Hello you guys and welcome back to the pig room or welcome to the pig room if you are new here I am going to be staying behind the camera today What I'm going to be doing is basically just giving everyone a full clean and showing you guys the entire process of how that goes down I actually ended up skipping their spot cleans last night one because I knew I was going to film this video and also two I was extremely exhausted so it kind of just worked out to make this video so everyone's cages are looking very messy as you can see uh, lots and lots of hay that's all scattered throughout here we're going to be doing litter box changes as well here is Lennon and Willow's cage they just love to make a mess with their hay and then we have our boys cages down here which is super dark I actually ended up ordering some Christmas lights which are coming in the mail today and then here is Leon and Mr. Styles cage messy Lots of poops, things are thrown all over the place, lots of hay. And then we have Mr. Jojo, who's just hanging out in the dark. He just loves to sleep in that litter box. And then we have Mr. Ashton over here, who as always is trying to get into Jojo's cage. And he just loves to just push everything towards the middle and just make a mess out of everything. And then we have just little bits and bobs scattered throughout the entire room. So a messy table, this needs to be organized. This is all my clean laundry, some disarray of randomness. And then we have some other stuff over here. These need to be organized these drawers right here stuff needs to be put away as well so we have got a lot of work to do in today's video if you guys are here for the first time I have 16 guinea pigs living in nine different cages so when it comes to full cage cleaning days I definitely have my work set out for me typically I'll end up doing the top cages on one day and then the bottom cages on another I find this works a lot better for me because one I don't have as much laundry to do and also two it doesn't take me as long but like I mentioned before I did end up actually skipping spot cleans for a lot of the piggies so everyone is actually in need of a full cage clean. I have so much clean laundry that's hanging out right here. Pee pads, towels, liners, accessories, bath mats, all kinds of things. I do also have two loads of laundry in the washer and dryer right now. So I probably will end up using that when it's done. But I'm going to have a lot, a lot of dirty laundry. For how messy these boogers can be, they love a clean cage. And it's just popcorn after popcorn. So I love giving them a nice fresh set of liners and pee pads because it really does make them happy. Now I just wanted to show you guys how messy some of my piggies can get. Here's Mr. Kai right here. My little messy boy, isn't that right? Yes, you are. And you're anticipating to come out. I can see that already. Hi, my boy. <laughs> As you guys can see, it is incredibly messy. They've got things thrown in disarray. Things just don't make sense in this cage. There's so much hay as well. They love to just scatter their hay as well. Again, they're pigs. They love to be messy. But also, again, they love a clean cage. So we're going to give that to them today. And then over here, our neighbor, we have Ezra, who again is another messy pig who loves to just throw about all of his things, flip them over, put them in the middle. It's just, it's very, very messy. And I don't get it. I don't get why you're so messy, buddy, but I love you so much. Hi, Mr. Mr. Troublemaker. Oh, what are you doing, Mr.? No, 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 no. And as you guys can also see, a lot of my boys are climbers, which is why they have all of these grids along the top because they love to escape and jump out. If you guys missed on my Instagram or on YouTube short, I actually posted Winston escaping. He climbed up two entire grids using his teeth and his paws and actually ended up escaping. He's been doing it for the last couple days and I really wanted to capture how he was doing it. Um, so I snuck into the pig room and actually caught him and Come to find out, he was uh, he was doing it that way. Um, he is such a smart pig. I honestly don't think he's a pig. He was definitely something in his other life. Uh, he's like a dog, cat, and a human mixed in one. He is seriously the best pig. He really does love me and lets me do anything to him. But even this could not stop him. We have to actually binder clip because he is so smart and has learned how to actually open these up. So you're staying in there, bud. So we've got a lot of work to do today. So let's just get started and we'll uh, begin with the top cages.
Alrighty guys, so this video is actually coming to an end early. I seem to have misplaced my battery, my replacement, and I don't know where it is, so I'm only working off of this one that's in the camera, and I'm noticing it's getting very low and it's starting to blink red. So unfortunately, I cannot finish this video and finish the rest of the cages and showing you guys me cleaning them, but I did get done five out of the nine, so I do have four to go, but I'm going to be doing that after this video, but I wanted to end this off on a good note and open up a package that I had received from one of my friends, followers, subscribers. Her name is Jana. She has been someone I've actually talked to quite a bit on Instagram and she had sent me over a care package and I'm really, really, really excited to open it up. I have literally no idea what it is. Probably shouldn't be swinging this around. It's in a nice big box. It feels really heavy as well. I love getting packages from you guys. It's like, it really is Christmas day. It's just really, really exciting, especially when it comes to my pigs because honestly, I would much rather have items for my pigs and myself. So that's what really makes me happy. All right, so we are inside the box. Let's go ahead and see what it is. Oh! <laughs> Jenna, you hooked me up. Oh my God, you guys, this is literally like what my orders look like when I order from Chewy. All right, so the first thing in the box that we were greeted with Oh my god, is this something for me as well? Um, are these Oxbow Timbells. These are my pig's absolute favorite toy alongside with something else in this box. It's something about this material, the condensed Timothy hay that they love so incredibly much. They destroy these within like less than 24 hours. So we have two of these, which actually ends up being four. There's my math right there. And then we have one of my pig's ultimate, ultimate, ultimate favorite toy as well. I wanna say that you probably, oh, there's actually the old brand in here. So this is actually the old packaging. If you guys don't know, All Living Things actually rebranded into uh, Full Cheeks. Funny enough, I actually was on TikTok the other night and I got stuck on the dumpster diving side of TikTok. And when they were actually rebranding and changing out from these to these, this brand Full Cheeks, there was so many people that found all of the All Living Things items in case just inside the dumpster. So I really wish I would have went there to one of the dumpsters when this was all going on with the rebrand because I would have been stocked up. So thank you so much, Shanna. And then, oh girl, you got literally everything that my pigs like. Oh my, you know me too well. Or I should say probably you know my pigs too well. She got this Celebration Cupcake, uh, the Enriched Life line from Oxbow. This again is something that my pigs really, really like. I've only ever given it to my herd and Caroline was actually the one who destroyed this in literally less than a day. I know a lot of piggy owners out there who actually have this and their pigs don't like it whatsoever, but there's just something about Caroline and this toy specifically that she just loves so much. So I'm really excited to give this to her. And then, as always, you can never have enough of these. Uh, Jana, you are stocking me up right now. We have the Oxbow uh, Natural Science in the urinary support tablets and then the vitamin C. I love to give treats like these to my piggies at least once a day, especially the urinary support and the joint support for my older piggies, just because it is a good preventative tablet to provide any prevention from bladder stones. And it makes me kind of have peace of mind just knowing that my pigs are getting a little bit of an extra boost to kind of protect them from bladder stones. And then the vitamin C ones are really good in case I'm like running out of veggies and I didn't have enough. So this is kind of another way to provide them with more vitamin C. So definitely was in need of more of these. I'm really, really excited to give them those. And then I am seeing that we've got, I think a t-shirt and some kind of snack in here. If this is pretzels, I'm going to love you forever. Oh my God. <laughs> If you guys don't know, um, I actually talked about this on my live. I am pretzel obsessed. It has been my most favorite snack ever since I was a kid. Any and every kind of pretzel out there, I like soft, hard, um, different kinds of flavors, different kinds of shapes. I love pretzels so much. And I actually talked about this being my favorite snack on live like a really long time ago. Um, and Jana was at that live and she hooked a boy up. It's only fair for us to go ahead and try these on camera. Oh my God, are you kidding me? I have no idea what these are seasoned with, but I'm being transported to heaven right now. I'm definitely gonna be snacking on these later tonight. And then lastly, we have a t-shirt. I don't know what this is, but we're gonna see what it is. Oh my goodness, furry potato. <laughs> Guys, this is literally my first ever, well, my first ever was guinea pig jungles, guinea pig shirt, um, but this is my first ever shirt with a guinea pig on it. Oh my goodness. I'm wearing this my next video. That is for goddamn sure. This is so freaking cute. This is amazing, Jana. Thank you so freaking much. You seriously are the best. I'm gonna be messaging her after this video to thank her for all these goodies. This actually is perfect because I do have 
sorry there's pretzel in my teeth i do have a video planned uh probably for my next one that i really want to film so i'm not going to give it away just yet i did a little bit of a sneak peek on one of my instagram posts so maybe you guys can go ahead and figure that out but i'm actually going to be using this for a video that i have in mind which i'm really excited for i've been meaning to actually film this video for quite some time now jana your products are going to be put to use not only for the piggies but for this video coming up thank you not only to jana but all you guys for watching today's video i really hoped you guys enjoyed watching make sure as always to leave a like and also subscribe for more videos every single week and until then i hope you and your piggies are happy safe and healthy and i will see you guys next week bye guys Thank you.